Hey, I'm Mark, and today I'm going to show you some soldering tips on solar cells. I get a lot of questions on my other YouTubes about soldering, and it's not sticking, and they can't get it to work. And, uh, there's a few critical things that I don't really go into detail on the other videos. And, um, I use a Weller 40 watt soldering iron, and the shape of the tip is a is, uh, pretty large. There are other tips that come with it or pointed and more of a tighter screwdriver shape. I like the bigger one. You need that that mass to carry the weight and it's critical that you keep it clean. Um, I've just soldered about 10 cells here and it's already dirty. And When I say clean it I don't mean to do that. It's got to be cleaned and I use a file. And I'll just take and get rid of all that oxidation that's on there. The oxidation will get in the way of transferring the heat. And you think you have plenty of heat in your iron, but it's not getting through to melt it. So now that I've got it nice and clean, we'll get our cell laid out. And I'm using the 186 rosin pin. Also use CL flux sometime, either one will work. Pin's a little more convenient. Just put out a, a strip on it. And I'll get my cameraman to get in a better position over here for me. Alright, we're ready to attach the tabbing wire. I just simply lay it down, use a little weight to hold it in position, and then I'll scoot my cell in the right spot, hold it down, and you'll see the tabbing melt. You can kind of see it getting shiny. Let me hit that end right there. And you can't immediately go and solder the other side. Um, you got to give it, you got to give the soldering iron a chance to reheat that tip up, and that's also critical. So, really, by the time you get your next one in position, take your time, don't get in a rush. Hold it down again. And we'll re solder. You can see the solder melting out in front of me. And that's all there is to it, and you just do. It takes time, a little practice, and I said after about after about 10, you gotta hit it with that file again, because it'll stop, it'll oxidize, the heat won't transfer, and you'll be battling it. And you won't understand why, and you think you don't have enough heat. It's, a, it's just a simple matter of keeping it clean. Thanks.